I always say at the beginning how excited I am to do my videos, and I do get excited about every single video I do, but this one is especially exciting for me because it involves one of my favorite products, and it's at a more affordable cost at 50% off. City Lips is actually having their BOGO sale, which is buy one, get one free on their all of their City Lips lip glosses, the opaques, the shimmers, the clear, all of those, but this time they've included the Beyond Mascara in there as well, which is so much fun. Again, thank you City Beauty for partnering with me and sponsoring this video and also sending me all of the lippy products as well as a gift so that I could show them to you. We are going to get right into a try on with that and a comparison on the mascara. But before we do, I do wanna tell you that normally I would put in here my outfit that I have on. I'm gonna just link my last video so that you can go over and see that. So if you're interested in the outfit that I have on, go over and check out that other video. Also, I do wanna tell you that this sale starts on November 10th, 2023, and it goes through the 17th of November. So you have to put two of these products in your cart. You can put two city lips in there. You can put one mascara and one city lip in there. You can put two mascaras in there if you want to. Also have the links to the lippy page and I will have the links to the mascara down below. Also, if you're interested in the makeup I have on, that will be listed below as well. All right, first up is the City Beauty Beyond Mascara. I first tried this years ago and I forgot how much I love this. It builds volume it builds length and it does hold your curl all day long it doesn't flake on me it definitely doesn't smudge on me and we talked about the fact that i do have that under eye sweating so bad which is so weird but i do get that so i don't have any problems with that either which is great the wand is a natural type bristle brush these aren't natural bristles but they're that's not the regular plastic bristles that you sometimes see because of the way that the brush is designed it really gives you some great volume and usually I can make just about any mascara work but not every mascara will give me volume that's what this one does I really really been enjoying and having this mascara back it's been one that I've been reaching for over and over again now we're going to try on each individual lip gloss beginning with the clear one now the reason that I absolutely love this is it is a plumping lip gloss I will tell you that when you first get a tube and you open up the tube, it also almost smells like when you open up a jar of vitamins. For me, that smell out of a jar of vitamins tells me that there's some really good ingredients that are going to be really good for me. And I feel like City Beauty does a great job with their ingredients as well. It definitely feels plumping and the results afterwards are, I feel like I have a really juicy, plumped up look and it tingles a little bit yes i do put this one on at night right before i go to bed every night this is the lippy that i use almost as a treatment because what happens is i will have this on when i wake up in the morning my lips will still feel really hydrated really supple instead of drying out and me having to start from scratch and getting them hydrated and plumped up so that's the clear one that's the first one i don't know if any of you have ever done this before but boy your lips take a beating after you try all of these on all right now we're going to try the opaque ones starting with the color pink nude it does have a little bit more of the pink color in it i actually choose this one because i do like my pinky nudes instead of a little bit warmer nude so that one is pink nude the next one is Tokyo Kiss, and I feel like this one is a little bit lighter. If you're wanting something that looks beige beige when you put it on, this is it. If you're somebody that loved that 90s kind of, you know, dark smoky eye and then the really pale lip, you might really love this one. This one is called Tokyo Kiss. The next one I absolutely loved this summer. This one is Watermelon. It is this beautiful pink color with a hint of peach in it and it just went with just about everything this summer i really enjoyed this one so if you're looking to do a more neutral eye but you don't want your face to look lifeless reach for something that has a little bit more color in it for your lips and watermelon with city beauty may just be it the last one in the opaque lineup so the rest of them after this will be shimmer but this one is crimson my good friend kimberly from pretty over 50 wears this all of the time and i'm telling you that woman looks 
stunning in it. What a beautiful color for fall, right? This one is crimson, would go so well with fall makeup. All right, now comes the shimmer ones. These two right here, this one is called Tinsel Town. Now it does have the shimmer in it, but it also could just be a really pretty topper because it really doesn't have a lot of color in it. So this could be one of your ones if you're doing errands, you know, you just want a little bit of life to your lips. This one that's called Tinsel Town might just be for you. This one is more of a pinky shimmery color, but again, it has a very sheer look to it. This one is called Los Angel Lips, or I like to say Angel Lips because it really does make my lips feel like they are just got angels kiss on them. This one is my favorite shimmer to put on top of all of my lipsticks because it just looks beautiful. It has a little bit of a gold reflect underneath that tiny pink cast of the lip gloss. This one is called Nude York. This one has a lot more color to it than those other two. It does have the gold reflex underneath. I reach for this one a lot because it looks so stunning on top of just about any lipstick that you have. It just gives it a brightness to that lipstick and it will make your lipstick just pop. Again, this one is called Nude York. Last but certainly not least is called Plum Springs. Now this one you can wear where you put a very little bit on and sheer it out. So I'm going to try that first to just show you. I'm just putting a small amount of it on. And then I'll kind of just pat around with my finger. It's hard to talk and do lips at the same time. But you can keep this more washed out look of the lip gloss if you want to. Or you can put it on, put it on a little bit thicker, and then you get the full effect of how pretty the lip gloss is. What a pretty color. Looks so sophisticated. Kind of a cross between a muted burgundy with a little bit of gold in there. It's just a really beautiful color that is very flattering, I think, on all different skin tones because it doesn't lean too cool and it doesn't lean too warm. So once again, this is Plum Springs. That was the last one of our try on for all of the city lips and then the beyond mascara of course is what i do have on my eyes also today i'll make sure that i remind you a couple of times during the sale in the community tab so you remember that this sale is going on i think it's one of the best sales that they have and i think they only have this a couple times a year and i try to stock up and get as many as i possibly can if you have any questions about city lips or the beyond mascara let me know down in the comment section i'm more than happy to answer any of those hope that you're all having a really great day please take care of yourselves and I'll catch you in my very next video. Bye my friends. <music>